as part of um the things on the jobbing block for discussion today because it has been uh well quite a while since i had a uh a regular uh discussion type segment of stream and whatnot and um it was some time last week like a few days ago and whatnot uh pyromancer for the people who do not know who the fuck he is um had another uh common pyromancer l type moment where he said or well no in this case he said something really really fucking stupid and um like double down on the shit and whatever and uh when i was um gathering things to talk about today uh, i ca came into the knowledge that his uh that twitter account is gone now which is kind of funny but um also kind of infuriating because essentially what what he had said was uh something about something about people complaining about ads and then something about um if you can't uh like manage a certain average like due to five hours you're not much of a streamer is some shit like that and and it's funny right because and 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 i know that i'm about to go in like full-blown rant mode but this is like really really important and like worth saying and shit i do not like the streamers and the content creators that as soon as they get into their bag and stuff and they get up there they just start immediately punching down or like like they're coasting along for a good amount of time and then they just start punching down like a motherfucker right now i found a screenshot that was taken from um someone else's stream of the tweet the was up the stream and it reads <clears throat> sorry to tell you this because it's gonna break your little heart but if you're a streamer that doesn't even average three to five viewers you aren't much of a streamer. Stop walking around and spotting opinions about streaming as if you have any idea what's going on. Sorry, not sorry. Okay? Here's the thing, jackass. You, at a point in time, were a part of the can't average three to five people crowd, right? Because everybody starts out like that, right? Everyone doesn't immediately come swinging out the gate with 30 40 500 average viewers in shit and it, it bothers me it bothered me quite a bit because you were once a part of that crowd you were once in the vicinity of oh well I don't have like a real audience. You you were a part of that people. You were in that group. There was a point in time where your YouTube channel wasn't getting any fucking views. There was a point in time where your Twitter wasn't getting any fucking traction. There was a point in time where your Twitch wasn't doing shit for you, bro. And 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 that's the thing. That's the thing, right? It it's always it's always coming from like marginally large to large to super huge streamers and i'm really gonna try and harp on the streamer part specifically but it's always the big streamers that are like punching down and being like oh well if you don't have this and that you're not much of a streamer and it's like did you forget that that applied to you before pyro or any other uh, 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 content creator that you know made it out the trenches and they're some level of successful do people just like frequently forget that that shit applies to them too because like i said earlier it's not like you just started out of the gate with a ton of people and 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 huge followings and shit you didn't start out with a fucking partner colored spoon in your mouth you didn't start out as an affiliate you had to work for that shit dude you you had to you had to put some kind of fucking work and you know it it's it's hard enough 
trying to build traction for yourself when it comes to just streaming because streaming is a thing in and of itself and you gotta you know do all this other shit i've talked about that before not really trying to go into it again but to just spit in the faces of people that do that shit is crazy to me and then and then the 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 part about stop walking around spouting opinions about streaming and shit it's like dude it's almost like there are there are mountains upon mountains of data that's out there that's easily searchable with a fucking google search people can look this shit up for themselves it's not hard to gather information about something that's been going on for a long time streamer or not right because before i started doing the whole streaming shit right i was like huh i wonder how like the numbers and the data and the research for all this shit looks let me look into it right i did it for fun i i did the research and was looking into the ins and outs and the numbers side of streaming for fun before i actually decided to fuck around and do it because why not i ain't got nothing to lose and then like as i continue doing all this stuff i continue to research and check numbers and look at things like like twitch tracker and social blade and blah 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 blah. i'm in and out of people's chats and shit it's not hard to gather data look at numbers and then formulate an opinion based off that now i don't necessarily know why he said or made this tweet but uh i've seen like quote we see talking about like he was tripping out on someone over ad the stuff and it's like dude first of all who is making like hella money off ads if you're not a part of the ad incentive program or 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 you have the the numbers and the viewership that would constitute seeing more than just like a couple dollars off of ads and shit bro like i don't understand this shit and and, and i have this video of him like talking about it pulled up and i've already seen like uh, the average, like, Power Man's apology, and they're just not good because they ultimately wind up being non-apologies and shit, but, like, dude, I don't understand the people who punch down, I don't understand people who defend ads, because shit has gotten to the point now where you have, like, like, moderately signs to big people being like, yeah, bro, use the ad block if you can't sub, because fuck this ad bullshit, like, even they don't like it, and they're the ones getting paid off the shit, bro, I don't, I don't get it. I really, really, really don't get it. So, I'm gonna start this damn video and watch it and just say whatever needs to be said about it. And, uh, yeah. Because cause, cause I, st I started, I did, okay, hold on, before I start the video, I did, like, look at some of the comments and shit, and it's just people being like, you never learn. You keep, you keep doing this shit. Pack it up. Leave, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So, I've got a. I'm 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 pretty sure that uh, this is not going to be a good video because if his own damn audience didn't receive it very well, uh, yeah, yeah. That that that's all I gotta say. Anyway. And I already don't care. I, 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 <laughs> <coughs> I already don't like this because I, 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 I don't like the trend of fucking like streamer has a colossal level fuck up and then they start their apology with the <sighs> shit like bro, bro. You're not gonna get your your early onset pity points. You're not gonna get. Just play the fucking video. Conversation with you guys. Are you capable of doing that? Because the 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 shit that you got yourself into before, like with your other past dramas, um, you just kept doing the same shit, bro. 
And 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 further context, right? Like I've known about Pyro, um, like back when he had his super meltdown over WoW, and he was like, "I'm not buying WoW shit anymore," and that's when he jump shipped into Final Fantasy. Like I've known about him since then. Watched some of his older shit, and I was like, "Okay, he's a interesting individual." And then like, like I watched him enjoy 14, but also like clown the shit out of himself. In a not funny way, and uh, yeah, I've seen some of his uh, his 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 meltdowns in real time, and I'm not I don't I don't like the kinds of streamers that like like go after their audience and 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 fight their audience, not like a ha ha you're dumb kind of fight. Like I'm gonna ban everyone type fight. That nah 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 nah, bro. That I do I do not I do not like that. And that happens a lot with Power Manager. I'll leave comments open on this video. Uh I know people are gonna rip me apart. Um I I think it was potentially a mistake. <laughs> Get to the point. To disabled comments, so I'll let you guys say what you wanna say. Um uh, I uh am pretty known I'm well known, not just in Final Fantasy, but in World of Warcraft as well, for not really thinking uh, too much before I speak. That's not an excuse. I'm t mm. I've had to deal, and many other people have had to deal with too many jackasses using the whole, uh, I don't think before I speak excuse as like an out for the dumb shit that they would say, right? I'm so tired. I hate, I cannot stand people who use that as an excuse to try and justify whatever clown shit that they say. It's so stupid. It's so, it's such a cop out, bro. Like, like, cause, 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 in the same breath, right? These people would be like, "Oh, if you say something, you gotta own up to it and shit." But when, 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 when it's time to face the music, then it becomes, "Oh, well, I have the habit of not thinking before I speak, and therefore I say that shut the fuck up." No excuse, bro. Because whatever comes out your mouth, you thought about it. I don't give a damn if you if you want to do. Why well, didn't think about it? Very, no, no, you thought about that shit. You thought about it, and you 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 wrong as hell. You, I hate people that use this as an excuse. I've had to deal with too many of them in my personal life, saying out of pocket shit, racist shit, homophobic shit, transphobic shit. No, 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 no. That's no excuse, dog. That's that's no ex fucking excuse. Are beneficial for like the streamer. It's not, no, no, shut up, 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 shut up. Okay, so you mean to tell me you 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 mean you mean to tell me that? You flipped out and had a didn't think it through moment because because someone else someone else that ain't you was annoyed that the price of Twitch Turbo was increasing and not adding any benefits to commendate or like compensate or anything that would make sense it's just a hard price increase and someone else is saying to their audience to use an ad block and she and this this person is well within her right to do so because that's their stream, their community, their audience and shit. And you 
you had a problem with that and you decided to tweet out that bullshit where you punch down at people that don't deserve it and spit in the faces of those that um, fall into the demographic of 3 to 5 or not averaging 3 to 5 and you say that shit and you all because of someone else saying to use an ad blocker because oh wow it's almost like advertisements are ruining the fucking website holy shit damn you know that's crazy right you know some people some people cannot afford to subscribe to every single person that they watch on Twitch. Some people do not have the spare coin for Twitch Turbo, which I, I just looked it up as he said it. It's now like like $11. $11 to have no ads on the whole fucking website and shit. Some people ain't got it like that. But you know what is? free and doesn't cost you shit an ad blocker ad blockers cost nobody anything and i hate i hate this stupid fucking argument of oh well if you block ads that hurts the streamer no no Ads, period, hurt the streamer because everybody is not going to know what ad blocker to use and what ad blocker that works, okay? Not everyone is tech savvy enough, even though it's very simple to get an ad blocker, but that's neither here nor there, right? Everybody ain't got the shit, right? And it's already bad enough that... The second you load into a stream, boom, 30 second ad, 15 second ad, bullshit, unskippable, you can't do anything about it, right? Okay, now that we got that established, the moment you tab into a stream and it's some shit you don't want to see, guess what most people do? They click off because they're like, oh, I don't want to see this, I want to watch streaming. So they go to someone else, and then someone else, and then someone else, right? It's a perpetual loop of how can I just get into a stream and not immediately be hit with an ad. Ads are ruining and harming the website and i don't give a damn it, wh whoever sees this right i already got a whole rant about ads and shit how they ruin the damn website and i'm not gonna regurgitate too much of that but bro bro if you're not already making bank from the ad incentive program because in order to get like a reasonable amount of money from ads alone you need to have like a pretty sizable regular average audience because it's not like oh one person saw an ad hey here's a nickel here's a dime here's a quarter no a certain amount of people have to see those ads in order to get a substantial amount of money right and if there is someone that fits under the category of a small streamer and they're only averaging like 10 20 they ain't getting shit, bro. Ads are hurting them. Ads hurt everybody, even the big people, right? Even the people who got like two, three, four, six, eight thousand concurrent average viewers all the time, consistently, bro. Even if they're already up there, the ads still hurt them because, you know. A streamer could be talking about something really important or they could be playing a game or they could be having an event and oh like this really huge thing is about to happen oh what's that three minutes 90 seconds a minute however long of unskippable ads that ruin immersion that ruins the content that ruins people's enjoyment and you and all these other people want to sit up here and keep defending that shit? Bro, nobody on this site 
is making a wild amount of money from ads to the point where using an ad blocker would hurt them. Ads suck. I I cannot tell you a single person that I know of who has made Twitch payouts from ads by themselves and they do not fit in the category of a large streamer. They do not fit in the category of having a hundred plus average viewership on regular and they get a Twitch payout from ads alone. Ads don't do shit. I hate this 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 stance that people take time about no yeah the ads are necessary they they help people shut up no they don't they don't because all someone has to do is just press a button on their stream deck no matter what when they get ran period whether you look at them or you don't they just gotta get ran I did that argument irritates the fuck out of me dude because it's like, what? Out of everything to take a stance for and defend, why this? Something that is proven and that many people have talked about as far as hurting viewership and hurting growth. I'm not even gonna talk about the dog shit with Twitch algorithm. It's just the ads alone are stifling people. Jesus Christ. And, you know, tried to. I was. I was. Trying to take the stance of like, you know, what I initially said was I retweeted it and I said, or, you know, consider subscribing to support streamers, you know, and not everybody can do that instead of using ad block because I, I would rather, and I know I've said this, I don't know how many times before, and I know other people have said this, I don't know how many times before, but I would rather someone not give me money and use an ad block in exchange for having an uninterrupted decent time watching a stream because that is light years better as compared to being hit by ads and paying money that some people may or may not fucking have feel like using like ad block you know it it's like fuck you twitch but at the same time like it does technically hurt the streamer too but i said i made some other remarks after that that were more aimed at people that i don't think really were at all deserving of what i said uh, i guarantee he's only saying that after like the collective amount of people that were saying you you should not be punching down. I guarantee the only reason he said what he just said is, you know, before he Thanos his Twitter, people was telling him, bro, you attack, you are attacking the wrong people. You attack people for no reason, dog. No reason. Um, and that was that, uh, you know, if you're a if you're a smaller streamer, you know, around. You know, and you can't even hold, you know, like three to five, uh, you, know, con you know, consistent viewers, then you're not like much of a streamer. And like, and maybe you shouldn't like, you know, have such a big mouth about uh, like ad related feedback and stuff like that when you don't really like benefit from the ads because you don't have a lot of viewers. Right. It's crazy to me. How. When people do their 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 punching down bullshit, they also do it in the way where they're like, "How dare you talk about this thing that affects everyone? Cause you don't have the credentials to talk about it." Newsflash, you bitch. Anybody can talk about anything when there is data to back the shit up, streamer or not. Averaging a certain level of viewership or not. If it affects them and it's been proven to affect other people, guess what? 
they can comment on it whenever the hell they want to. It it just it it, it never ceases to 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 baffle my mind at how some of these people are like, no, you can't talk about this and this and that. You you you're not allowed to <coughs> to talk about something that many a people, big, small, atom sized, the size of Jupiter, are are, are affected by and talk fuck you, dude. Fuck you. Which obviously is like like you can insert the fucking meme of the whole room like face palming. You know what I mean? Like that's such a rough even paraphrasing, like it's such a rough thing to say, you know, just clearly not thought out. Not very like well Stop Stop I swear to God. Stop saying that as a fucking crutch. And you no know, continued on to say like like ads can make up a, a significant portion of your revenue and, and those kinds of things. And I made a comment about how, like, if you're using ad block and you're not subbing and you're not using Twitch, Pro, uh, Twitch turbo, then you're not really like monetarily supporting the streamer in any way, which is not entirely true because viewers, you know, every viewer does matter. Every viewer does count. And I got to run that back. I just want to make sure I heard what I just heard. True. In any way. Twitch Turbo about how like if you're using ad block and you're not subbing and you're not using Twitch Pro, uh, Twitch Turbo, then you're not really like monetarily supporting the streamer in any way, which is not entirely true because viewers, you know, every viewer does matter. Every viewer does count. And I think Is that your weird convoluted way of saying you only give a fuck about the money, bro? Is that Is that what that's supposed to mean? Because you you being hard stuck in this adds this adds that dog shit and then being like Oh yeah, no guys, uh, the viewer count matters and it's not really true if you're doing all these things and you're not actually supporting the stream. Really? Alright. I said two different things that like, you know, that made smaller streamers feel really bad. And I want to clarify like what I mean. Because you attack them for no reason. You attack. You... <laughs> <laughs> you attacked a whole demographic of streamers for no reason. You said that catastrophically stupid thing going after a large group of people that's out here trying to do something. You attacked them for no reason and now you're trying to now you're trying to be on oh well let me clarify what i said and like bro no you knew exactly what the fuck you were saying dog and and, and apologize you know i i certainly i don't want to feel like i'm your apologies are hollow as fuck because every time every time every time you find yourself in some self-created drama because you don't speak before you think Head ass. Every time you're like, oh, I'm sorry. It won't happen again. I'll be better. You don't get better. You keep doing the same shit. Your apologies are hollow as shit. You know, crapping on anyone's dreams. You know what I mean? That's not the point um, at all. And it definitely came out that way of like, well, you know, you're not a fucking streamer if you don't have... A lot of views and people you know the, ob the obvious response to that is like well everyone starts somewhere and that's definitely true yeah just like how you did and i can explain all the little semantics of the situation but i think the bottom line is that i you know i made a bunch of people who aspire to what i do 
who maybe only ever even turned on a stream because they watched mine. <laughs> don't start, don't, don't, do not continue going down this road. And I say to them, you know, I don't care about your opinion because you don't have viewers is, is how it comes out. Like, wow, it's almost, it's almost like that, that is how a lot of bigger named content creators actually conduct themselves and shit and it's almost like that happens more often than what it should and it's almost like if someone that watches someone for so long and then they're suddenly like i don't give a fuck about what you and anyone else like you gotta say because you ain't shit guess what they're going to be offended by it because the one person the one person that they thought would potentially give a shit about them because you know they 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 kind of sort of you know give a shit it's like oh hey surprise they don't like what the fuck you know so i definitely earned ire for that and you've I, had ire you know, against you for a long time i say about like ads and ad blocking and stuff like that the intention certainly is not to make anyone feel like because they haven't achieved a certain level that their voice doesn't matter. Because that's not the case. You've done that and before. And many also, people, many people of your size and bigger and some smaller have done that before. And it's also because I'm just remembering another tweet that I saw um, in relation to all this. He, he, he also started like tweaking the fuck out because... Um, his like numbers are starting to dip and like everyone's numbers kind of sort of dips around the end of May and shit because surprise people got shit to do and whatever. But nah, he tweaking out because his numbers ain't like, you know, gig as huge as when he started streaming um, 14 and grand, they've been, you know, trickling down for a little bit. But I he, it, it, it's crazy how he's going to attack people for viewership while his own shit is going down. So like, don't want viewers to feel like just because if they can't sub that they're not like worth anything and i think for that's that 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 is that is more or less what it, what you were fucking saying though this ain't the first time that you didn't say something similar to this shit bro people that consistently watch the stream of which there are still many believe it or not uh they you know understand like it, uh, there's been moments in the chat where someone's like oh you know i would love to sub but you know uh, i can't until payday like sorry pyro and i'm like i'm never like oh dude like pfft, like brokey can't focus you know what i mean like that that would never be my response it would always be like dude don't damn that's crazy don't worry like maybe someone can gift you a sub or something like that. you never apologize for that like stop 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 i i'm not i'm not i'm not i am not i am not interested in you trying to backpedal and make yourself look like a good guy in this scenario shut the fuck up and keep moving on that is not the impression that i want to give i know that i know that and like it doesn't matter if you're it really doesn't matter if you're sub or not i i'm i fully am aware of that um so i don't want it to seem like i feel entitled to your money or anyone's money because I'm not. Uh -huh. I'm only able to do what I do because of viewer support, and consistency, and... So why do you continually get into fights and attack and spat with your audience? If you give as much of a damn as you're saying, why do you always do this shit? Why do you do this? Because it doesn't it doesn't make any sense and again again going back to the shit about the viewership and whatnot you at a point in time were a nobody you would not be at the point where you are now if you did not have people that gave a fuck about you 
and you keep trying to throw the ones and go blow for blow with people that put you at the point where you are now and then you just treat them like shit bro like like there's no reason why so many so many of these comments are like yeah dude you know you were cool and i respected you and i used to watch you like all the time but then you started doing all this crazy shit you started attacking you started telling us we didn't matter bro you do not care you do not care i the, the comment the comments alone are saying them enough and your own all your watchers are telling you to fuck off get off the internet and shit you keep doing this to yourself you keep blaming your oh i have this issue and i have that issue and i'm not this and i'm not that and yada yada, yada. you keep doing this to yourself this is your fault you do not care it's almost like like if you keep attacking your viewers they're gonna stop watching you because clearly majority of this comment section i looked at the comments that before I'm watching the video i looked this like 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 a few hours ago because I'm like, there's no way, there's no way Pyro fucked up this hard, right? Right? No, I was wrong. I was wrong. He keeps doing the same shit over and over and over. So many people are like, oh yeah, I used to support him and now nah, I can't fuck with him no more. And you know, he's this, he's that, he's not changing. If your own community is consistently telling you to stop doing this shit and, you know, this is the final shot, not gonna fuck with you anymore, this is your fault. Don't sit up here and be like, oh, I care about you guys, but then, like, you know, there is a paper trail, a laundry list of history of you, like, going at your viewers maliciously. Not for jokes, not for funnies, not for shit posts, no. You are, f it is, you, you turn the shit into a you versus them. That's on you. That is on you. And you only have yourself to blame for this because now, now the people who fucked with you and people who stood by you, they don't want shit to do with you anymore. They don't want shit to do with you anymore. And the people that have know seen me through the thick and thin and and there's a lot of them uh thank you know thank goodness for that because you know it's i've said and done a lot of dumb shit you guys i'm as taylor you know like pyromancer like i said is is, is an entity is the online so okay so now 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 you're gonna try to spin the whole oh i play up a character on stream fuck that no we're not doing that because that is an excuse. That is a way out of this shit. And we're not doing that. No. Persona, so to speak. But it's not like... It's not like... I, per, I, I in my personal life, I'm like... Oh, fucking... Sm you know what I'm... Like, it just... It just I get I get like upset and it just... And it comes out so fucking stupid. Like, and just not thought out. Like, I need to... Like one, you know, a piece of feedback I saw on Twitter a couple of times was like, you really need to read your tweets and like read what you're saying before you before you post it. It's like, you know what, you're they're right. And how about how about how about if you just stop relying on, oh, I don't think before I speak. Maybe. Just maybe shit would be a little bit easier for you, you know, maybe. Just maybe. If your ego wasn't the size of the universe, you wouldn't consistently get yourself in the shit. You know, just, just fool for thought, fool for thought, you know. And I have literally l lived with this struggle for my entire life. <laughs> um, you know, I'm not going to I'm not going to go ahead and, and, and blame an inability to like fucking it's not even inability. I'm not going to blame like failing to, to you know 
proofread my shit, make sure I don't sound like an asshole on on my mental issues that I have. But it sure as fuck does not help. <laughs> you know, it's it's just you know. You do not do a good job of portraying that you are not an asshole. Um, and it's just, you know, I've how many how many fucking you know how many things have I done now that have tarnished the 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 pyromancer name and and you know made made taylor as a person look like a fucking asshole to however many people out there because at this point your entire fucking streaming career just stop pack it up and leave bro you're done you just need to stop at this point because like i said earlier like i said earlier you keep doing the same shit you flip the fuck out on people that do not deserve to be flipped out on and then you're like oh i'm sorry guys it's this it's that bro People are tired of hearing the same regurgitated bullshit over and over and over. Stop. Just, 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 just pack all your shit up because you, you clearly, you clearly do not have the mental facilities and the, the, the self-restraint in place to do this shit without constantly getting into the same exact problems over and over and over. God damn, this shit, uh, this shit is irritating, fucking, dude. You know, streamer stuff and fucking chairs, dude. Like, it's, it's, it, it, it like, I understand, like, why I get memed. Like, I, I. I understand, you know, like why people have the perspective that they do because it is what unfortunately has like arisen in a in, in a common perception from the shit that's happened and there's just like you know, I Can you stop trying to look sorry and like like can you, can can you can you stop with the typical content creator apology type shit and just you know, keep it fucking moving? I I I don't I don't believe that, like, I as a person am quite what a lot of you think that I am. And I hope that at FanFest I can show you that if I get to meet you. You going to FanFest at this point will probably be a fucking mistake. Not, not, not to be like, not to be all like, oh, he's going to get swung on and shit. But there's probably going to be very few people that are like, fuck with you after this shit. Cause like like apparently you got into some weird shit with Xenos, you got into some weird shit with Zeppla, bro. Like I really don't think anybody's gonna fuck with you for real, for real. Like like it it would probably be a very lonely experience for him. And show you know some humility and that I'm just a person and um, that I I'm, I know that and I just you know I don't know. This isn't. I I also want to throw out there. This isn't about like. Oh, you know, break the emergency glass, you know, like I like there's been some people that have unfollowed and I'm not expecting that putting out a video is going to bring people back. That's not the point. I you don't you the following that you have, you you clear, you've clearly shown that you can't handle it. You don't deserve that shit, dog. Mostly just wanted to apologize for for, you know, the same shit over and over and over aspiring streamers feel like shit and feel uh invalidated and uh because i think i just i think i have a way of being kind of like self-reductive in that like i i don't i don't think i often consider enough like like maybe how many people have have at least at some point seen a, a snippet of my content a piece of it got an impression of me maybe it was good maybe it was bad and you know like i just i think that i don't think that i fully grasp like the like how many people are going to see it how it's going to affect people like how it's going to make people feel like i don't know i guess i guess sometimes i forget that like People ha give a sh <laughs> that people give a shit about what I have to say, and it's almost because you, it's like your ego's a fucking problem, huh? Uh, you know, I'm not trying to I'm not trying to like get pity for that at all. I'm I'm just, you know, it's a 
a thing that I struggle with and uh, and not just when I am streaming I mean it's something that I struggle with you know all the time and I think um, that's another discussion for another video uh, I don't know I, I don't know if you guys would um, like to hear uh, how things have been going mentally for me we can um, no I can talk about that if you're interested like I've been I've been seeing a therapist is this gonna be the rest I've of the video medication for a while now um, and I don't know if that's something that might help people not okay but I really do think that there's been some good things to talk about and I think just uh, I don't know um, I just haven't been in like a headspace uh, and like there it is. is I haven't been in a good headspace I'm gonna use that to justify all the fuck shit that I've been doing and he he's pretty much going down the fucking checklist of typical streamer youtuber influencer apology and shit 